The ultimate aim of martial arts is not having to use them. Think lightly of yourself and deeply of the world. You must understand that there is more than one path to the top of the mountain. If you wish to control others you must first control yourself. It is difficult to understand the universe if you only study one planet. Today is victory over yourself of yesterday, tomorrow is your victory over lesser men. Do not regret what you have done. All men are the same except for their belief in their own selves, regardless of what others may think of them. Do not sleep under a roof. Carry no money or food. Go alone to places frightening to the common brand of men. Become a criminal of purpose. Be put in jail, and extricate yourself by your own wisdom. Perception is strong and sight weak. In strategy it is important to see distant things as if they were close and to take a distanced view of close things. The important thing in strategy is to suppress the enemy's useful actions but allow his useless actions. The true science of martial arts means practicing them in such a way that they will be useful at any time, and to teach them in such a way that they will be useful in all things. You may abandon your own body but you must preserve your honor. A man cannot understand the art he is studying if he only looks for the end result without taking the time to delve deeply into the reasoning of the study. Anger. Control your anger. If you hold anger toward others, they have control over you. Your opponent can dominate and defeat you if you allow him to get you irritated. The only reason a warrior is alive is to fight, and the only reason a warrior fights is to win. Do not sleep under a roof. Carry no money or food. Go alone to places frightening to the common brand of men. Become a criminal of purpose. Be put in jail, and extricate yourself by your own wisdom. Anyone can give up, it's the easiest thing in the world to do. But to hold it together when everyone else would understand if you fell apart, that's true strength. Nobody is strong and nobody is weak if he conceives of the body, from the head to the sole of the foot, as a unity in which a living mind circulates everywhere equally. Do not think dishonestly. Distinguish between gain and loss in worldly matters. Develop intuitive judgment and understanding for everything. Perceive those things which cannot be seen. Pay attention even to trifles. Do nothing which is of no use.